Hey what's up everyone, it's Frankie with Meekspace.com. Today I was going to take a few minutes and show you how to use iSilo to download theocratic files to your Android device. So the first thing you'll need to do of course is visit the, uh, <clears throat> the Android Play Store and uh, download iSilo. And uh, once you have iSilo installed on your device, go ahead and open that up and we'll do this now so once you open it up you should see uh, a screen similar to what you see here along the top it'll say recent new cat faves and device and um, what we want to do is go into the download section and use the built-in downloader of iSilo to get our files now we don't have any other buttons or anything so the way you do that is your device should have an extra menu button somewhere. Now I'm using an S3 uh, Samsung phone. In fact, I'm going to put it in front of the camera here. So here's the phone that I'm actually using. You notice down here I have a back button and you can't see it, but I have an extra menu button. It's you know looks like a piece of paper with writing. When when I hit that button, I get the three extra buttons that we need to have or the three extra links. Now if you look on the screen there, if I hit my menu button again, um, those go away. If I hit that menu button on my device, now any Android device is going to have a menu button, but it's located in different places. Sometimes it's a physical button on the device, sometimes it's a touch button that's on the touch screen, but it's, it's, a, it's a function on your Android device, it's not built into iSilo. Okay? So you hit that menu and then you'll go into Tools and from tools you want to choose download and then you'll choose URL and it should take you to your home page or whatever page you last had up on your screen so this is just a built-in browser so we'll want to go to the, the the box shared link and so you'll just get rid of this stuff here and, and go to www.box.com slash meek space so box.com slash meek space and go next it's going to change your link to a mobile link but that's fine just just leave it like that now here is where I would hit the menu button again remember that's the button you can't see on the screen it's on your device hit the menu button and choose bookmark this way you can actually save the bookmark of this page so you don't have to type it every time. Now you just go ahead and hit add and it'll save that. Now if we wanted to come back here again we would just hit the menu button again and we would choose bookmarks this time and that'll show you all your bookmarks. See I've added this bookmark several times but uh, you can just hit your backspace to get back. So this is our our main page here that we want to log into so notice under the word box it says in the blue line it says please enter the password for this share so we're gonna go ahead and enter the password that you get from meekspace.com this password does change from time to time so you'll need to log into meekspace.com and get the correct one and once you enter that password then just go ahead and hit the submit button now if you notice the submit button there is right below where we type the password. Make sure you don't hit sign up or log in. Make sure you hit the submit button. That should log you into the box share. Now from here, we want to go into iSilo. Remember, we're, we're logging in from iSilo, so the only files we can download this way are the iSilo files. So go ahead and choose iSilo. If we're trying to get, for instance, the Watchtower Library, we'll go into English. We'll go into the folder called Watchtower Library. <clears throat> Excuse me. And you'll have four files. You'll need to download all four of these files. I'm going to choose this third one because it's the smallest one. And then you'll just choose the download link. What should happen is your device should say, where do you want to put it at? And if you notice your current folder, I'm my current folder is SD card downloads iSilo. Or we can choose to put it in a different link. Um, I'm going to just say current folder, but remember where that's at. I you know you might even write yours down. 
SD card documents iSilo. So I'm going to choose current folder and it's going to download into that folder. Now at this point we have the option of going ahead and opening that file or we can say no and we can hit the uh, in the blue line where it says watch our library that'll take us back to the watch our library folder and we can go and get the next file. See we don't want to view it because we're trying to download all four of these files. And You just hit download. Again you want to put it in the current folder We'll say no again. Hit the Watchtower Library link at the top to take us back. And um, then you'll want to go ahead and get those other two. Now those other two are quite large files, so I'm not going to download those. But what we are going to do now is we want to go find those files. Well, we downloaded them into iSilo, so we should be able to hit our extra menu now Remember the menu button is a physical button on your Android device and hit done. That takes us back into iSilo. Now you notice what took us right into our default location where we were at. If you notice there on the screen it says SD card documents iSilo. That's where it's going to download our file is wherever we were at when we went into that download screen. And if you notice we have our files, the RBI8 and the NWT. Those are the two that I downloaded. Now if you go ahead and click on one of those, it should open it right up. And this of course is uh, one of the versions of the Bible. It's the, it's the smaller version or the smaller uh, link that we use to link to. And so you have to have both of these files uh, in order to, for all your hot links to work in, in the Watch Our Library file. But anyway, this is just a demonstration to show how to open that up. You can hit the X in the bottom corner and go back to your root of iSilo. So that's how you do it. Um, a, a refresher, the extra menu button on your device, you'll click that, go to tools, go to download, choose URL, and it'll go to your home page, but if you hit the menu button again and go to bookmarks, you can choose one of your bookmarks you saved and it should take you right to your bookmark that you saved. Enter your password, click submit, and you should be good to go from there. I hope this tutorial has helped you.